Welcome to How to Forge. Today we will show you how to create a website in ISP-Config. First, go to your ISP-Config interface. Log in as a client user. You can do this as an admin user too, but it is not advisable due to security reasons. Once logged in, go to the Sites tab. Click on Add New Website and fill in all the needed data. You can choose whether you want an outer subdomain, which may be www or none. Please remember that if you select none, your website will not be reachable without www. You can also select if you want to support PHP. If yes, you can execute PHP scripts on your website. If you only need static websites, it's advisable to disable PHP. Click Save. The red icon at the top shows you that the server is processing it will disappear in about one minute. In the meantime, you can create a database and database user. Go to Database Users in the left menu and click Add New User. Click on Generate Password. It's not advisable to choose a custom password because mostly they are chosen insecure. Click on Save. Click on Databases in the left menu. Click on Add New Database. You can now select the site that you created previously and fill in a database name. Then select the created database user. You can also select a read-only database user if needed. You can leave the database char set on default. Click Save and wait for the server to process. To be able to upload new content, you will need an FTP account. Click on FTP accounts on the left side. Click on Add new FTP user and fill in the credentials you need. Please remember that your username is prefixed by the client. In this case, if you enter test, the username for the FTP user will be Mr. Tester Test. Choose a strong password or generate one and click Save. The domain, website, database and FTP account are now created. We can check this by calling the test domain. As you can see, your website is now set up. You can now upload your data by FTP with a created user and it will show on this website. Thank you for watching.